Oh, my name is Nicole Clems, and I, I had to introduce Ria Kole to USC Architecture. Okay, I'll introduce myself. CEO of the Aries Lopro Novella Enterprise, a digital agency for upcoming young stars. And um, basically, we are going to writing and other creative skills, like a skill hub for young creatives. And as an individual, I, I write, create um, video advertisements for business owners as well as designs. Okay, going into what we have today, I, I'm talking on the topic, sorry, as it relates to the team for this um, program. And from the definition I have here, sorry means to rise up or to or increase, meaning to go from one level to another level, like a lower level to a higher level, whichever way you'd like to put it. And as individuals, growth is a necessity. You know, like we are all we are with this like this before now. Like we all went from um, babies to children and teenagers and adults. So that's like a growth process. So growth occurs in every aspect of our lives. Could be spiritually, mentally, or physically. Then there are different areas where one can actually soar. You can soar in your line of interest. That is anything you know you'd like to do, you can soar in that aspect. You can soar in your academics as students. If, yes, we are students here too. You can you can soar in your business or in your workplace. You can soar in just about anything you do as an individual. Like I used to say, anything worth doing is worth doing well. And I'll just be brief. I'll go over to how you can soar. And I talk about, sorry, you say show up every day. For you to like, okay, let me narrow this down in the aspect of maybe um, your work as an individual. We all know that these days, everybody is on the digital space and we are doing one or two things. You know, everybody, writers are there, writing, um, digital marketers, entrepreneurs, anything. So now, sorry, in terms of um, um, you on social media, you need to show up every day. Because you cannot just come out and say, I am into this. Okay, you have a business and you create your business um, portfolio on social media and you just say, you, I think people will just come and be like, okay, this person, nobody will know you if you don't show up. Nobody will know you if you don't put up things for them to be able to relate with you. So you need to show up every day. Secondly, you have to give value. A person of value is somebody that people would like to sort, like people would like to um, follow, go after, get to know you, get to relate to you, and also trust you. Then another method is you engaging in people's activities, people's posts, influencers, and um, popular pages. Groups. These are ways you can actually build yourself if you are the type that is social media inclined. Then the same thing goes with being active. So people, so people, people may complain and say, eh, "I'm on social media, but I don't do anything." Like my agency is a writing agency. Like we deal with young writers, and we've had um, stories from there. They'll be like. I'm a writer, but nobody knows that I write, or I'm scared to put up myself there, I'm scared to wake up in the morning and post on social media. And most things I tell them is, you cannot, people cannot know you if you don't wake up and show up. I'm into marketing now. Every day, like, I follow an influencer, and they can't do this, I don't know if we know him. I talked about shameless marketing. How you wake up every day and put yourself out there. Because if you don't, Turn up, you don't show up. Nobody will know you. And the major end goal is to like get sales, make money for yourself also with your brand and whatever you're doing. So if you're not that 
ways you wake up every day and today you put up something that actually relates to who you are. People will be like, this person is not serious. Like, one of the speakers talked about um, um, value, like you focusing on a niche that people can identify you with. Then next I say, follow Honoru. I like this one very much. There are people that know what they are doing that you need to sit down. Even if you're not learning with them, like, you're not seeing them face to face. You have to, like, get to know them based on the things they are doing. Read their books, read really stuff for their courses, etc. Then next, we'll be looking at why you should soar. Um, as an individual, you need to grow your in, your influence, right? Online and on, um, uh, better online or physically, so that people can relate with you. It's just like when we are in school and we are like, um, um, when we are in class in our classrooms and teacher has this teaching and there's this popular student that this teacher always likes to everything. Meet Michael, meet John, meet this person. Why? Because this person actually took his time to study and do things that actually make him be sorted out for. So if you want to so you need to like grow your influence, learn things that will put you at give you give you a and put you at an edge. And to make people associate with you. Secondly, you want to be a sort out, sort out for. So you want people to always refer to you whenever they want something. I want to, I want to, um, for instance, um, I need a writer, refer to this person. So anybody can just easily say, go to this person because they are seeing you show up. You are always seeing their face, putting yourself out there. I need a videographer, with this person. I need a photographer, meet this person. So that is just it. Then you need to make money. In this age, and people say uh, making money, you go to work, and people are not making money online with their skills. So you need to let know how you can make money around what you do, learn a skill, and you'll be on your way. Then lastly, I'll talk about, I'll talk about how we can solve. And you have to have a determined mindset. The most this thing I noticed that our mindset is actually a limiting factor. So if you know you for you to like be where you want to be, you need to make up your mind on and decide on what you want to do. Secondly, you have to be ready to walk. Because you cannot just say I want to do this and you just relax and expect the whole magic to happen. It doesn't work that way. Then start you have give into learning. Learning is very important. Every day we are learning new things, you pick the things you need to pick from, things you need to keep aside, things you need to grow with. Then next, show up. You have to show up. Be consistent. Keep putting yourself out there. And, and you, you saw. Hallelujah. Okay, so I'll, this is where I will join the curtain on. Sorry. Thank you very much.